Well hey everybody, we're going to be doing part 2 of this Kroger grocery store. Part 1 will be down below in the description. Go ahead and check that out. Now let's go ahead and finish this off. Alright, now what we're going to do is grab the sandstone, the sand, and the birch buttons. And let's start off doing this right back here where the dock area is. Right here above this little doorway. Your sandstone, this is going to come inwards a block like this. So, in other words, right on top of the brick here. You're going to add 13 right here. So this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, and 13. It should line up perfectly right on top of there just like that. Now what you're going to do, double this up. And then right down here you're going to come across like this. And this is going to be double it up as well. This here. It's going to be doubled up and this is going to go all the way down down here so that there is going to come down here and this is going to wrap around like this all this is going to be doubled up all the way across all the way down there now right here on top of this pillar this is going to be 13 as well so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 and this is going to be 3 wide right here 1 2 3 the same as this pillar right up under it so on this side, on the front, three wide here, the same as the pillar right up under it, and this is going to go on up, just like that. Now this here is going to come across the front, doubled up. just like that and right here is going to be doubled up as well and this is going to go all the way up to there and this is going to come across and this also is going to be doubled up and then the sand is going to go right in the middle of all this Alright, now you should have that filled in with your sand right there. Now with the birch buttons, what you're going to do is go to each corner of the sand. Place a button, skip a block button. This is just for decoration. So every corner, you're going to do this here. Just like that. Right down here as well. Alright, now once you've got that there, as you see down here, I went ahead and took that sandstone all the way down, went ahead and carried it down, connected it up. Again, it's doubled, two blocks tall. And now what we're going to do is take this here, and this is going to go around, double tall here as well. The sand is going to come in right here, and you're going to do the same thing with the birch buttons. The sand is going to wrap around the corner like this. The buttons is going to be like this, just like what we just done. And now, all you got to do is take the sand and go all the way down to the end there and 
take this also all the way down double this up and this is gonna end up right down here right here well, alright now this is what you should have this all filled in and don't forget to put your buttons in there just like this alright now once you've got that then let's go ahead and come right over here and let's fill this in so the sandstone it's gonna be pretty much the same as that there so right here you're gonna come in a block right here like this this is gonna come on down to here and right here where this pillar is you're gonna add 13 so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen the same thing as what we've done on the other pillar now right down here you see it's in line with that one three wide and this is also going to be doubled up just like what we've done here so this is going to be doubled up like that and then the same as what we've done here double it up on top this is gonna come on down to here this double it up up top and then you're gonna fill this in also with your sand and then you're going to do the same thing with your buttons on the corners. I'll fill all that in, put your buttons in there. Now, right here above this window, it's going to be the same, is right down there. What you're going to do is you're going to go in a block like this. And this sandstone is going to come across like that and this is gonna come up even with this one so it's even with that one and this here is gonna come across like this and it's gonna come back behind it like that so this here is just simply going to be filled in with your sandstone alright now once you have all that looking like this then what you're going to do is copy the same thing right there is what we just done copy it right down here all this so right here above the window just like what we've done right over there it's gonna come in like this it's gonna go on up right here it's gonna come across it's gonna be doubled up just the same thing as what we've done you're gonna fill it in with your sand and use your birch buttons as well well alright now once you've copied the same thing as what we got down there on this side then what we're going to do is go right over here on the side of the building and it's going to be pretty much the same as down there it's just going to go down a little bit further so this again is going to be doubled up and this is going to go all the way down up here also this is going to be doubled up and it's going to go all the way down and right here on the pillar this is going to be three just like what we've been doing like right here is three so this is gonna be three also and we're just gonna take this all the way down and we're gonna do the same thing we're gonna fill it in with your sand use your birch buttons now when you get down here It's going to look something like this. This is going to be doubled up. It's going to go around the corner. 
your sand on top there and just like what we got right over there this is gonna go up against the wall and this is gonna be doubled up right here and your sand is gonna come like this well, alright now this is what you should have all the way down all this filled in and again going around the corner here this is what you should have well, alright now come back around the front and I'm gonna use the gold blocks to count some blocks here you're gonna need the prismarine brick and also some string so right here on the front next to this little window here we have the sandstone right here and I'm gonna be counting up right here on this pillar so right here is one two three four five six and seven I'm gonna place number seven right there we'll come back to that eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen and fifteen knock out that sand place a prismarine brick right here and one right here then place two more right here these are gonna hang off like this and once you got that then just go ahead and get rid of this here now right here where we have this marked out we're gonna take the string we're gonna place the string right here place one right off of that and then place three right here one here and one here once you've got that then take your sand and place your sand right on top of that string like this so this is what you should have now so do the same thing as what we just done here on that pillar there Well, alright now once you have both of these the same just like this then what we're going to do is come right up here and we're going to add six more stair steps like this so it's one two three four five and six right over here do the same thing one two three four five and six now right here you should have three left it's one two and three they connect that up just like that Well, alright, now, as you see, I went ahead and put a little arch right here using the gold blocks, and that's going to help us out when we count these. Also, grab your string. So, right here up front, what we're going to do is count off of this pillar right here. So, right here where we have this sand, floating sand here, you're going to count up one, two, three. The fourth one is the one that we need right there. So you got three blocks in between here. And then you gotta have two gold right here. And then you gotta have two single diagonal gold here. And then two here. Two more. And then right on top of that, you're gonna have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen and then it's just going to do the same as the other side so it's going to be two 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 diagonal singles and then two here and it's going to be the same one two three and then the fourth one's going to be that all right so now once you have that then go ahead and get your string i'm going to use a string to do the same with the sand floating right on top of it now your, your string 
you're going to place right here on the bottom of this gold block. Take out these two gold blocks. Place two sand right there. String on the bottom of that gold block. Take this out. Sand there. Self-explanatory. String under there. String there. Two string here. Sand there. The same thing. String here. This is going to come across. And right here we're going to place the sand. The string right there. Take this out. The sand right on top of that. And the same thing. So string. String there. String here. String here and string there. Take these two out. So now all you gotta do once you have your sand like this then you're just gonna come back here and just fill this in just like this. All up top. Alright, now once you have that fill in your sand up top, then we're going to go ahead and grab the sand again and fill in the inside here. But what we're going to do is come right on top of this black concrete and we're going to have this go across like this. So this here is going to be filled in all the way up on the inside just like that well, alright now let's go ahead and do the lettering as you see I went ahead and, and used the gold blocks to make it a little bit more easier the count we're gonna replace it all with the blue concrete so let's go ahead and do the K first right here off this pillar where we got this sticking out it's gonna be even with this it's gonna be two blocks with the K right here. It's going to be one, two, three, four, five. Right here in the middle. And then you're going to have two here. Two here. And then it's going to come up by two right here. And this is going to curve around one two, three, and four, and then it's going to come down by two right here. Alright, now with the R, you can look at it right there and know exactly how to do it. It's very simple. One block in between. One, two, three, four. One there. One block in between. It's going to be just like this. One block here in between. All these are really simple. And then the G is going to come around like this. So right here you're going to have two, one, three, and then two right here. Now this part is very, very important that this here goes in the middle of this O and the G goes in the middle of the O like that. That's how it's how it is in real life. Now right here, the E is one block from the G again and the R is one block apart. So the E I just went ahead and made this derpy E right here. Down the scale that's the best I could do. And then the R is just like this.
Alright, now once you have the lettering there, let's go ahead and grab the prismarine bricks and the prismarine brick slab. And what we're going to do is extend this. This is going to be a total of 22 blocks, counting these two here. So this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, and 22. So all of these here that we have, all of them is going to be brought back, even with this one. Total of 22, all of them. Now, once you have them all taken back, then you're going to grab your half slab. And the half slabs are going to go in here like this. And this is going to be on both sides. Now right here, you're going to skip that one in the middle. You don't put that one there. Do it like this. This here is going to come down like this. And then you're going to end up placing these on top. So these are going to be ran the full 22 all the way down. And these are going to come right on top of this here. Make it a nice shape. Now right here in the middle you're going to place one there. And then these half slabs are going to come down right here just like this. So go ahead and bring all these back, a total of 22 blocks. Well, Alright, now this is what you should have. This brought back a total of 22 blocks, both sides all the way down. And don't forget to take your slabs and go up under here like this. All the way up and across like what we've done on the front. Alright, now let's go ahead and grab the door right and go right up under here and the same thing is going to be on the other side as well so what we're going to do first take the sandstone right here go ahead and take this down right here and right here as well and right here now once you've got that, then you're going to take the door right. The door right is going to come off of that, just like this, and this is going to be filled in with this door right, all the way down, just like this. So go ahead and do this same thing on the other side as well. Alright, now this should be filled in like this. So what we are gonna do now, come up here and that side over there should be filled in as well. Both sides the same. Now we're gonna put some lights in here, glowstone and the cauldrons. So what we're gonna do now is come right here in the middle, grab your cauldrons, right here in the middle, you're gonna come in by a block right here place your cauldron, skip two blocks, cauldron, two blocks, cauldron, and do this all the way down. Now right on top of these cauldrons, you're going to drag the glowstone across. Now you're not going to be able to see this up here, all this is going to be covered up, so it doesn't really matter what it looks like up here, you should end up with one right there. Now grab this glowstone, and like I said, this is going to be brought across like this. And go ahead and do the same thing on the other side as well. Alright, now come to the back of the building, and we're going to take the sandstone and just fill all this in back here. So this right here up top, this is going to come across, connect up to the top down there, down here, this is going to come across and connect up down there as well so just fill this entire back up with the sandstone alright now once you have this wall filled in with your sandstone all the way down let's go ahead and come right to the front and we're gonna need the sandstone stairs what we're gonna do here is take these stairs right across the front upside down 
when we get right here you're gonna do this here wrap it around like this and simply carry this all the way down all the way around this building when you get to the sand it's gonna stop like that do not wrap them around like this just stop just like that continue on the other side of that sand pillar when you get to the corner here you are going to wrap it around this stair is going to go all the way down wrap around this corner it's going to go around this corner go all the way down this side all the way around the back all the way around this side this side and then whenever you get to right here it's gonna wrap around like that this sand pillar again is gonna come up to it like this do not wrap it around that and then just continue this up against here wrap it around just like this so go ahead and do that all the way around the building alright now once you have your stair going all the way around the building now grab your prismarine brick slab and right here on the front go ahead and come out like this and then you're gonna take this on down and when you get to here what you're gonna do is come out like this right here now this here is going to go around the entire building around the top when you get here just keep on going this is gonna go around the entire building this is gonna wrap around the corner like this and then once you got that all the way around the building then what you're gonna do is the same thing right up here like this this is gonna come across like this when you get to this point here it's gonna be like that so again this is gonna go all the way around the building and then you're gonna do it one more time and it's gonna be on this level right here and again the same thing this is gonna be like this going around the entire building just like that alright now once you have that slab going around the entire building around the top then what we're gonna do now is grab the anisite now this anisite is gonna come right up here up top and you're gonna carry this all the way around so this is gonna be like this this is gonna curve around like this right here and you're gonna carry this around the entire top of this building all the way around alright now the next thing you're gonna need to do is go ahead and place a block here you won't be able to see it so it's just fine you're gonna carry it all the way down until you get to the end right here where you got this hanging off by one block and you're gonna take the sand and the sand is gonna go right here and this is gonna go all the way down to here like this fill this wall in real quick so you should have that and go ahead and do the other side the same way now what you're gonna do right here is you're gonna take this along the back right here this is going to curve around the front there you're going to do the other side the same the back is going to be filled in with the sand all the way up as well well right, now you should have this right here all filled in and that is going to be on both sides like this and the anisite going around the entire building all the way around like that now what you're going to need to do is choose your block that you're going to fill your roof in and this is going to come down on this level right here so go ahead and fill the entire roof in with your block alright now as you see it's all filled in and this is what yours should look like go ahead and put a few AC units things like this right here just something really random but it looks really good up here just a few things here and there scattered around well, I hope that you all enjoyed this tutorial and if you did please hit that like and let me know what you think down below. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all next time.